Well, this is a tradition. Fathers and sons who have served with the Tampa Fire Department. Their photos fill several albums. There is a bit of a new twist here. For the first time in the department's more than 100-year history, it's a father and daughter who are making a new tradition. Fox 13's Lloyd Sauer shows us how she followed in his footsteps. A fire in an attic may not be the way most people like to start their day, but for rookie Tampa firefighter Lauren Glanton, it seems to come natural. That was my alarm clock. Honestly, I woke up and it was fire time, so I put the gear on and it was time to rock and roll. Answering the call runs in the family. Lauren's dad, Larry, a Tampa paramedic, has seen it all. Broken leg, gunshot wounds, overdoses, and everything else. So when Lauren made history in a fire department more than 100 years old... I am the first father-daughter. It didn't come without some concern. And I told her that, you know, we're going to see the worst of the worst. I said, people are not going to call us for, like, for example, cookies and ice cream. They're going to call us when... Things are really bad. But in his 24 years of wearing the uniform, this father of four may not have noticed that Lauren was watching all along. And I've seen him in action before. Like, there have been times when we're at church and someone passes out and he has to go into action. And Lauren may have picked up more than just boots and a helmet about how to help when things go bad. Like, you get to hug that mother that just lost her child or console that woman who's freaking out in a car accident. Being that shoulder for someone to lean on or when their day is going horribly, you're that calm that they get to see where they're like, okay, everything's going to be okay. I can do that. When she was sworn in, even the grizzly veterans needed a moment. Yes, I was. <laughs> I shed a tear, but I got to be strong. I was good until another district chief started crying. <laughs> then I started crying, and everybody started crying. So My mascara was down yeah. here. Yeah. You won't catch either one crying when they're on duty. But when help is needed, Tampa's first father and daughter are ready to answer the call. Lloyd Sowers, Fox 13 News.